In this video, we will go over the SQL where in clause. The where in filter returns values that matches values in a list or a subquery. A basic syntax is select your columns from your table name where your column is in a list of values or from a subquery. So we're going to go over a couple examples of using the where in clause. We're going to begin with this query, select product ID and product name and color. So normally we would have a where clause, say for color, equal to black. And that would allow us to return one color. But now we want to have a unique list of colors return to us. So we would have in and we would have a list of values in the parentheses and every value needs to be separated by a comma. So we have black comma red and let's add silver comma silver. And we execute and now we should have only black, red, and silver returning in the color column. Now let's use numbers. So for numbers, we'll use product ID. And numbers are a little bit different. They don't need parentheses or quotes, I should say. So let's Use product ID one, two, three, and let's add another number, uh, three thirty-two over here. And we'll run this. And now we get back four product IDs, the four product IDs we have in, in the list. Now we can also, let's go back. and uh, do it with the subquery. So let's have color in, and then we're gonna have a subquery. We're gonna select color, And from product table, and we're going to have our filter be where color greater than, and we're going to put B. Or let's put C and see what we get. We're going to close that subquery and right now we're having colors greater than the letter B. That would be excluding A and B colors, which would be only black from this query. So you see we're returning everything but the color black and uh, we can try to take out another color. Let's do above R. I think R is the next letter or multicolors next. So let's do above M. Above N. So color is greater than N. So really this M is not really for the first letter since it has multiple letters. And let's try for S and we still get silver. So it looks like we need to add in T. 
But if we wanted to be exact with the comparison, we would just write in red, color graded in red. Instead of R. So you see, it's returning a list of colors and the end statement is taking in those colors. So that's how you use the subquery. So that was the syntax for using a wearing clause with a list or with the subquery.